Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Cyberpunk 2077 with the Phantom Liberty DLC installed. I'm your host, Colors Fade. It's episode 71. We're in Dogtown. Kurt Hansen is dead. We have to call Mr. Hans. Yes. Hans, hey. My turn. I got a job for you this time. You for me? Peculiar. So listen, trusted runner, you of all folks got to have one on your payroll. Someone for special jobs. Special meaning high risk. How would it be declare your need? Next Max Tech prisoner convoy. Direction Los Padres. Need the route ASAP. Los Padres. Well, what you're planning is rather apparent then. I have a contact. One capable of extracting the information you require. For the right price. 15,000. Non-negotiable. Still interested? Symphony heads your way now. And I expect results, Hans. Transfer received. I'm sending the coordinates. Be there in... Bear with me. Ten hours. The data shard will be waiting. Encrypted, naturally. Accessible to you based on biometric identification. Oh, and do your utmost not to make a mess of this V. I despise cleaning up after others. Thanks. Later, hands. Okay. Meet the Netrunner in Kabuki in 10 hours. Well, let's make our way there then. And then we can do a little wait and see. We've got our fancy car. That last mission, not exactly how I thought things were going to turn out, so let's get rolling. How's everybody doing? I don't think we're too far away from finishing the DLC. I could be wrong. But it feels like we're nearing the end. This has been a wonderful, wonderful location though, Dogtown, the work that they've done on this to get the DLC here. I'm very, very impressed. I've been very impressed with this DLC since it came out. You can obviously see where CD Projekt Red was hoping to take the game from the very beginning, but obviously they got rushed for time and had to publish the game before it was ready. We all know how the the initial release went. But they have redeemed themselves quite well. And if Dogtown is any indication of what the next cyberpunk game could look like, we're all in for a treat. I'll skedaddle if you keep these roadblock here from launching my car into the air. All right, where are we going? On the little squirrely route here. We haven't been over to this side of Pacifica in a while. But it's a nice night for a drive around at Night City with the Blade Runner soundtrack, folks. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, everybody who's hung out with me this far on the series. And especially for the people who've commented on the music selection. It's been my favorite way to play this game. Even playing offline away from the Let's Play recordings. I always have that soundtrack going and it's quite wonderful. What is going on back there? This guy. <laughs> you might want to keep going. What is this? This almost looks like a new area. I don't remember this coming out of Pacifica this way, being this way, but it must have been. Dogtown's really the only new part, isn't it? 
Let's get out of the way of that guy. I'm so excited to learn everything about what the next cyberpunk game is going to be. Is it going to take place in Night City? Is it going to take place somewhere else? Is it going to involve V again? Is it going to be a continuation of this particular story? There's just so many things. So many possibilities to get excited about. And, and if it ends up being a game where it's even more polished than this one at this point. Obviously it wasn't polished on launch, but it is. It's pretty polished now. It's still got some little annoying bugs, you know? that I feel like are just an artifact of the engine itself. But look at that. The street reflection, that's just incredible. Neutralize perps. Oh, not what I meant to do, but that's okay. Oh, I can level up. I just accidentally hit that button. I thought maybe I could hit H for horn, but the answer to that question is no. We can do this. Dash. Left control to perform a dash. Okay, I kind of want to see how that works. Let's get back to driving. Though. I assume that whatever is going to go down here in Kabuki is not going to go well. Everything has gone sideways. Care for some advice? Caution, V, especially now after the untimely death of their master. Hanson's hounds will be tearing at each other's throats and at any outsiders who get in their way. Yeah, thanks. If that means you know of some people coming at me, now would be the time to let me know exactly. This is just a hell of a thing. Okay, where are we going? We're going this way. Oh, we're going this way. I don't have the fancy voice of a navigator in my ear scene. At the next 500 yards from now, turn right. The lighting in this game is really impressive. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Somebody thinks they're going to combat me in car combat? No, I'm getting out of here. Come on, guys. Let's see if they can actually catch up to me. They can, apparently. They're getting the beep. The beep. Oh, I needed to go that other way, didn't I? Okay. place to park and and wait kabuki well the gun store that's where all that shooting's coming from okay Well, let's wait it out, shall we? Ten hours, eh? Well.
I do like their clock. It's very nice. The delivery you waited for. Yoka has packed it up nicely and is waiting for you now. You know where it could look. Okay, I'll give him a message back. Yep, sure. Be there soon. Wonderful. Happy hunting. Yeah. Do I need to be upstairs for this? Maybe. Oh yeah, I need to be upstairs. Okay. It's so pretty. I don't feel like running around all over the place. I like to take my time, especially because it's starting to feel like we're getting near the end of the game and I'm going to be sad when it's over, even though I'm ready for it to be over. You know that feeling? V, it's been quite some time. What can I do for you? You know what you can do for me. Hmm. Listen, Yoko. Hands still you I'd swing by? It's about a gig. Oh, so it is you he meant. This day just got more interesting. First, I'll need confirmation our mutual acquaintance, in fact, sent you. Then we can talk. Connect here. I'll verify through biometric scan. Okay. Okay, have at it. Decryption will take a moment. Apologies. But it's necessary for a job of this caliber. Well, well, V? I didn't expect us to work together again. How is your running? Polishing your skills? <laughs> Not one to brag, but... Pretty damn good if I say so myself. Yet not good enough for you to dig into certain records for a certain person, huh? Ouch. <laughs> Below the belt, Yoko. Right? With the formalities done, let's begin. All you need is here. Just so you know, gathering it wasn't easy. The Max Tac Data Fortress is a labyrinth. And a panopticon combined. Every node you pass attracts a thousand unwanted stairs. But you managed. <laughs> You're my hero, Yoko. Wait. Our cooperation need not end here, if you catch my meaning. That is, if you plan to do what I think with this data. Interested? Hmm. Maybe. Now, strict hypothetical. What you think I aim to do? Let's suppose you positioned yourself where a certain convoy was to pass. Mm hmm And? And let's suppose you are either prepared or insane enough to eliminate the guards of the convoy. Hot or cold? Getting warm. Our mutual friend would offer additional thanks for the windfall that would result from this. If you would be so kind and send us the coordinates of the location where you deal with your problem. You after max that gear, is that it? Get there before anyone else does? Mm, you would only need to send the coordinates. Give it a shot, but no promises. I need the coordinates, nothing more. In return, I guarantee a generous reward. Good luck. Okay. Sending you data on the package being delivered to Los Padres, courtesy of the runner we can trust. I'll have a look, be in touch soon. Okay. Well then. You know that data's cause enough for Max Tack to Max Murdy. <laughs> They'll have to get in line. Touche. Alrighty. Let's get Reed's super spy peepers on this. See where it leads. I love that they got Johnny. It's great. 
that was actually kind of one of my concerns. I mean, he's kind of a minor character, but... Okay, let's see. I parsed the data. Decent enough work. A few blanks to fill in, but nothing we can't manage without. We got the transport's most probable security detail, and most importantly, the route. It's time we meet up. I got a couple contacts who agreed to deliver some equipment and help us set up. I sent you the coordinates for an old hotel near the transporter's route. We'll work out the details there. Okay. I'll be there. Let's get this done. I mean, they didn't technically have to bring Johnny back for the DLC, but they did. So I love that they did that. I, I assume Keanu came and, and recorded all that voice work later for the DLC, that it wasn't a pre-planned thing. It's great that he did. Like I said, he's not a major character in this part, in the DLC, but it's nice to have him there and just the continuity. It just, I don't know, I guess it shows how much they care about the game, in my opinion. CD Projekt Red feels like a developer that takes their IP seriously, which I like. Meet Reed at the abandoned hotel. All right, my friend. Let's do this. Where are we going? More driving, but hey. We have the Blade Runner soundtrack to keep us company, so it's not like it's a bad time. There's purple on the side of the road, and that was really hard not to stop and get that. <laughs> Even though, at this stage of the game, I don't really need it. Come on, man. Want, that was great. Want to get bitch slapped. Oh, that's funny. This game has some good stuff like that, that little quips that people give you. I like it. Like, in any game like this, what you're really trying to do is create the illusion of a city. There's really no way to actually create a city. The AI doesn't... There's not enough AI for that, you know? There's not enough processing power for that kind of AI. They're gonna come after me? They're gonna keep coming, aren't they? They want that car combat thing to happen, and I don't want to have anything to do with it. Get out of here. Where are we going from here? We're going... Whoa! We're going like that. Okay, we're turning left here. Great, let's go. Uh-oh, I'm on the wrong way. Well... Oh! oh that's not how that wreck would have happened. <laughs> that's not real physics. I've been in wrecks. That's not how it really works. But it's a nice thought. My poor car. Every time I get my fancy car out, I get a wreck. Oh, come on. Get out of my way. Got things to do. This is when the motorcycle is nicer. I just don't like driving it. I'm not a big motorcycle fan. The cars, on the other hand. I like the way they look. I like the way they move. I just don't like the traffic. <laughs> but that's accurate. That's real life. I'm not a fan of driving in bigger cities. I really like the fact that I live in a small town next to other small towns. So, like... The place where I live is a really small rural community. And then 15 minutes away are two college towns, which if you've ever been near a college town, they're not terribly big usually. Um, you know, unless you're, unless you're like, uh, what is it, Virginia Tech, which is right in the middle of Atlanta, you know, unless it's something like that. But a lot of college towns are pretty small, you know, 30,000 people, 20,000 people, something like that. The, so, the kind of a town where the size doubles while the kids are, while the kids are there in class. 
So I have really nice towns that aren't too big nearby where I can do things like go to the gym and go grocery shopping and all that kind of stuff. And it makes it really nice because the traffic is never so annoying that you that it makes you not want to get in your car. Like it's just normal. It feels normal to me. And it, and in my small town, it's there's no traffic at all, really. So. But I've I've lived in places and driven through places that are really big. I've lived in a town of about 250,000, I mean a city of 250,000 people before. I've driven through places like Denver and Atlanta, I spent a couple weeks in Atlanta once, um, and I'm just not a fan. I mean, eight lanes of highway in one direction is nothing I ever want to do ever again, <laughs> ever. <laughs> not for me, not my kind of deal. So Night City would actually be a place that I would not want to live. <laughs> I'd be a nomad for sure. I'd be like, oh yes, the free open air of the desert and the cactus. Okay, what's going on here? Assault in progress. Right next to where I need to be? What's going on here? Is this Six Street Goons? Who are these guys? Who is this guy? Z. Sixth Street Soldier. Wanted in Night City. Okay. Let's get rid of these gang goons then. Okay, how many do we have? Are they all Sixth Street? Is she Sixth Street? Yep. Okay. What do I have for cyberware? Do we just want to cyber psychosis one of these fools and then kill the rest of them? That'd probably be cool. Let's do that. Who's going to be the toughest one here? Who's this fool? Sixth Street Soldier, Bounty Class 3... Sixth Street Gang. He's got, yeah. Hmm, okay. Target not hackable. I can't hack any of these fools? Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, what can I do? I can't blow up the car. You mean I gotta shoot all these idiots? Okay, what if we're not supposed to kill these guys? They look like a bunch of losers, but maybe they're not important. Los Palapa, what? It's a motel. Whoa. A little foggy. Abandoned motel. Is this giving anybody else Blade Runner vibes? Jiggity jiggity home again, JF. Good evening, JF. Whoa. Jumping Max Tack now, are we? Stepping up your game. Busting into Arasaka Tower, it ain't. But it's up there. Somewhere. Trying to knock me off the arch-terrorist pedestal? The famed JS got a hot take on all this? On going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Max Tuck? Hell yeah. Good fucking luck. Cause you're gonna fucking need it. Mint Reed and Songbird. Huh. <laughs> What's there to say? Chit bought a one-way ticket to cyber hell. Floored the chew and cut the brakes. And she's dragging us along can say that again yeah she's dragging us along and she uh I still don't believe her for one second about being able to help me but I do think she needed my help that was not part of our deal Reed they get wind it was us this your partner 
Fuck me. Didn't know you'd signed on to some suicide pact. Need to do a better job vetting your partners, Reed. Because it seems you're now running with a murdering piece of human trash. Is that Mitch's voice from earlier in the game? Hmm. Cool it, guy. Could settle our beef later. This ain't the time or the place. Well, then, I just hope the FIA will send us new contact deeds once you're busy pushing up daisies. But if you do survive this cat orgy of an op, remember, you and me are square now. Can we shoot him now? Modern day patriotism for you. Yeah. So what's the score here, buddy? About time we went over the plan. Ready to plan, strategize, got everything we need. Got everything we can count on having. I flicked through your intel. Convoy routes, vehicle array, weaponry they're likely to have. It's not gonna be easy. The reason they're called psycho squads twofold. They're almost cyber psychos themselves. The best chance we have of stopping them is here. Traffic minimal, vantage points optimal. They'll come down this road. Once in range, we hit them hard. Bring them to a stop. We then neutralize all max tac operatives, grab Songbird. Run into an exfil point just across the SoCal border. Our friend here knows the specifics. He'll fill you in. I got one last thing I need to take care of. All right, let's hear what you've cooked up. Hmm. Here's a lowdown. Convoy will roll in from the northwest. Likely run right into the booby trap cars will set up. This could decommission a few vehicles. Force the rest to switch lanes. We'll cut off any chance of retreat. Set off some planted charges. Stop them dead in their tracks. Second read pops a behemoth driver. You'll dive in. Your chum read also requested some badass toys. Offensive turrets, mines, smoke grenades, ladder, not an issue. But the mines and turrets. Want a way in? Sift to the deets or leave prep to me. It's your call. No, you go ahead. Listen, your gear, you know best. Leaving the prep to you. Damn, quite the demonstration of trust. I'm flattered. No, moved. <laughs> okay, we'll do our thing. Preem, appreciate the help. Gonna have a word with Reed. Hmm. Gonna set up then, and make tracks. As for you two, well, good fucking luck. So we're getting help from 6th Street. No wonder I shouldn't have shot those people. Okay. That's good. What's it you said? Modern day patriotism? Because <laughs> you gotta admit, it came through. Anyhow, think I'm all set. You? Ready for this? Almost. This is our jammer. I just need to calibrate it so the signal isn't too strong. Otherwise, so me could. I just hope we're not too late. Too late for what? Reed? Let's focus on the task at hand. Damn it, what do I gotta do to get you to talk to me? We are talking. <laughs> yes, yeah, see that. Spill it, come on. You have any questions about Maxtech? Now's the time. Fuck me. Dodging always your go-to when the talk gets tough. Yep. You want to know the truth? Fine. Today, or seven years ago, don't know what exact point I fucked up. The end result's that now we're here while she, she could die. I just pray that she's, she's the one we're saving. The soul me I knew. And not some AI from the black wall. Yeah, I know, but I'm not Fucking sure. Scared V. Scared my grip on everything is slipping. There, happy. Here's the thing, man. I don't think she's who you think she was, and I'm not sure she was ever that person. Honestly. No idea who we're busting out of that convoy. But there's a chance it won't be... That she's not... 
you know. I know. That's what scares me. We need to finish this. I just gotta jam Max Tax frequencies. Get ready. That thing jamming his pangs of conscience, too? Ought to get myself one. What do you want about now? Chick's a half-brain-dead, half-AI-controlled zombie, yet still the gonk's convinced his old partner's trapped inside. That only he can save her. What would the Big J do? Abandon hope? Know what being in the army taught me? Hope dies last, cause the backstabbing bitch makes damn sure she gets you killed first. So you'll warm the fucking grave for her. Saw many thousand yard stairs. Willpower gone. Hope hovering for no reason. Wanna bet on miracles? Go ahead. I'll pass. Just talk to her. Huh? Body language. I could tell you enabled the relic. So was it her? Did you grab hold of Song? Uh, no, just a side effect of the relic. Your tunes of Langley have their work cut out for him. Right, understood. All right, jam is calibrated. Do you know what to do? Take my position, await the convoy. Going hot when I see the charges pop. We grab Song and head for the expo point on the border. Clean quick, no slip-ups, no trip-ups. And one eye on Song the whole time, got it? Okay, moving to my position. Good luck, Reed. We won't need luck. It wouldn't hurt. Where do I need to go? Oh, what's my... Mr. Hands. Hands in the... Qu oh, yeah. Okay. That's from before. We don't have to worry about that. Okay, where do I need to go? Any of these positions? Wait for the convoy. Well... There's stairs down here. We're going to do this in broad daylight? Brave. Okay, folks. We got loaded guns. Let's see. That thing's ready to go. And that thing. Mm -hmm. We're going to have to punch through stuff. So let's do it. Where, where am I supposed to wait? Right here. Right there. Okay. Bring it on, convoy. Okay. Waiting. I got eyes on the target. Alright, they're in, in the tunnel. Oh, yay. <laughs> really? Hey. Songbird? How the hell did you. I was. Not you. And it won't be you. So, me. You there? Link's alive? I trusted you, but I won't, won't mistake again. Stay out of my way. I, I'm warning you. <laughs> It'll be over soon. We're close by. Here to help. You and Reed help. You would break me out of this cage just to shut me in another. Soon I'll. Regain control. They're on a move. Get ready. Songbird made contact. Link's still active. She won't forgive us. Not for. Don't expect her to. We need to focus now. On my mark. Oh, we got a storm coming in. Fun. Let's do this. Let's give you. Oh, you want to give somebody cyber psychosis? I don't think so. Let's just go for contagion. 
let's give you a short circuit let's Everybody else. Oh, come on. He's got to be gone. Who else do we got left? Some fool from over there. Come on out. I'll make it quick for you. Okay. Let's. We can get you done. Where are you, darling? Chicken. Ooh, shiny. Where's Song? Right here. Check the truck. Yeah, I'm gonna. This ain't gonna go well though. I'm at the truck, Reed. Careful now. Yeah. Fuck. Where's my backup? Max tag. talking about oh my god what's going on enemy net runner nearby I'm getting my ass kicked Reed you might want to do something about this, homeboy. Oh, I got a, I got a head guy here. Okay, here we go, net runner. Keep it up. Oh. Holy hell! Finish it, B. I can't. Reed. Ah. What are you doing, Reed? I know Try I am. me, assholes. Get up here. I got some explosives. Get out of there. I can't cover you. Where's the net runner at? Right down there. Picked one a couple of times. Take him down. Pants on the fucker if you get closer. Yeah. We don't forget their implants. Wait till I score a hit and give them hell. Wait till you score a hit. Play tag Man, team game. I got a bogey in my crosshairs. Okay, fine. Trust me, this one's a two hand defeat. Won't take him alone. Come on! Is he down? Oh. Not so tough after all. Target in another. Okay, can I do anything like cyber warrior Don't forget their implants. Wait till I score a hit to give them hell. You all end up like that fucking psycho. Oh my god, that was interesting. That was a whole new game mechanic that I'd never seen before. Okay. Now what? Open the truck's rear doors. Okay, well. Action blocked. Alright. This game has a bunch of stuff that it doesn't want you to do at a certain point in time. 
let's go to our backpack and get rid of a bunch of stuff. Let's do this. What do we got here? We picked a fine time to, to get overburdened, didn't we? There's so much stuff here. Need to get enough of that. Okay, so max tech. Jeez. What am I looking at over here? There was something orange. Where is it? This guy? Oh, yeah. Okay. What do we got over here? Well, it's not that I need any of this stuff, but it feels wrong not to loot it while we're here. Neurotoxin knife. What the hell? Leave me alone. Don't follow me. Before it's too late. I'm hit. Goddamn shrapnel. Fuck. How bad are we talking? Reed. Shit. Okay, where's Reed? Where are you, my friend? Reed. Are you up here? Reed, my friend, where are you? There you are. I'll be all right, V. Got the luck of the damned me. Need any help? I'll manage. Shit was a moment there. I thought we were gunners. <laughs> nah, you and me, we bid him bye-bye. Go. Stay in the tail. We can't lose her. I'll catch up as soon as I patch myself up. You sure? Go. Save her, V. Well, I don't I'll think you can save I'll keep this line open and group with you as soon as I can. Copy that. I don't think there's any saving her, my friend, but there is Max Tech. We fought the Max Tech and we survived. Alright. Rubble. I need a car. Who are these losers? Don't suppose I can drive that garbage can. What do we got here? Gimme. Where's my car? Dude, where's my car? Let's go. Let's go try to get her. It's not going to end well, is it? Is everybody going to die by the time it's over? Where'd she go? Oh, she left a a trail of disaster, didn't she? Who taught you how to fucking drive? There were two cars in the road. Two, and you Holy were Jesus. into my ass. Show me fucking serious. Max had Looking at a wall with a huge hole in it. Moving, I was Truck ramp clean through. I look like I give a Advisor. shit. You take your okay? ass down. No visual yet. Need to scope the place out. Stay Holy shot. hell. She fell down here, it seems. I am like a moth to the flame to shiny things. Oh boy. Oh yay. It's how this DLC started. Parkour. The thing that Colors Fade is no good at. There's the car. Huh. Well, there we go. Song's not here. Truck's empty. See anything? Just the device that they were holding her in. Seeing something. A digital residue. Spooky aura. Spectral footprint. You're seeing it thanks to you and Somi's link. The black wall bleed should lead us straight to her. Bring her out alive, V. If I'm to help her. If I'm to help you. I need her alive.
Standing in front of a gate so me pass through. It's jammed shut. There's gotta be another way. Look around. There is. There's a gate down there. Gate's jammed. Console's freshly breached. Looks like more so me. Anywhere we can go. There's a down below. It says exit. Oh, great. Oh, brother. Are we going to drown now? Okay, hold on. We have something for this. What are we looking at here? Tactical diving suit. This is going to come in handy again, isn't it? This looks like a dead end, though. And that and this could get us through to here. It gets lift us loot here so that uh we'd have some kind of a clue. She's okay. in bad shape, V. She's actively linked to the black wall. She could lose the control, she still has it any second. Stay safe. Yeah, you too. I'll be fine. I'll rejoin you as soon as I'm back on my feet. You keep moving. Oh, great. Oh, who wants to go swimming? Not me. Somebody get me a helmet that's a little bit clearer than this one. Here we go. All right. Oh, what do we have here, Johnny? What do you got? Gaze into the abyss. You'll find the abyss staring right back at you. Oh, no. You're going to have to jump like down the there. Look, it's given me the kind that says there ain't no coming back. Yeah. Sure you want to do this? Not really, but I don't have a lot of choice. Any more pearls of wisdom yet? Why is it always doom and gloom with you? How about what doesn't kill you makes you stronger? Try this on for size. Go up against monsters. Best make sure you don't turn into one too. Supposed to be about me that? About songbird, you ding dong. I gotta explain every little fucking thing. Chick sold her soul to the Black Wall demons. Now she's down there waiting for you. Question is, is she still herself? Guess we're about to find out. I don't think so. And with that, we're going to end this episode. The next one will be a little bit longer. Buckle up. I'll see you on the next one. You know what to do. Leave the questions and comments down below. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. And until I see you next, happy gaming, everyone.